I'm Manju. Welcome to Sharing Cooking Secrets. Today I want to show you how to make these beauties. Aren't they lovely? Mini chocolate cups with coffee mousse. So for the mini cups, I've got this mold which is for small cups. I have my melted chocolate here and if you want to know how to melt the chocolate, please see the link below. Now I put the chocolate in an icing bag. So this is a really easy way of doing it. So I'm just going to make um, a small cut. Once you've done this, you need to tap this. Now we're going to take a butter paper and I'm going to invert this so all the excess chocolate is going to come out. Now to clean this, you just need the scraper and we just do this. And just leave this for a few minutes. So after a few minutes, just turn it over and have a look at it. And if you can see any gaps where the chocolate hasn't spread, then you can you can just take your chocolate and you can fix it in case there are places where you know the chocolate hasn't stuck. So we'll just clean this again and, and now we'll put this in the freezer to set. It will take about 8 to 10 minutes. How will you know that it's ready and it's set? If you look at the back of the tray, this, can you see right now, it's very chocolatey. But when it's set, this whole thing will become frosted. It will become like cloudy and whitish. So I have this OHP sheet or you can use a, any plastic sheet you have. And I'm just going to spread some chocolate on this. Now, with your bent palette knife, quickly spread the chocolate all over. If it comes out, it doesn't matter. and just clear up the mess. So I have this uh, round cutter and I'll just measure it for you. It's about a little more than an inch. Um, I've got my mini cups and I'm making the saucer, the plate for the mini cups. So just with this, once the chocolate is set, okay, we're just going to cut out circles. Always cut out extra in case some break. Now we're going to put this in the freezer to set for about 10 minutes. It's important to put the sheet into a tray and put another tray on top of it so the, the plastic sheet does not fold over. So it comes really nice and straight. I have some white chocolate here in an icing bag and I'm just going to make a, a small cut Now what I want to do is make this handle. Can you see the handle of this cup? plenty extra and we need to set this in the freezer again for around five minutes. I've taken one cup of whipping cream and we've whipped it up and I'm going to add half a cup of truffle sauce or fudge sauce, it's all the same. 
So it's not hot, make sure it's not hot. And we're going to add this to our cream. This is going to be the filling for our cups. And I'm going to put a little bit of coffee. So I've just taken half a teaspoon of coffee with a little water and I've just added it here. To mix this well, you can use the beater if you want. So our chocolate mousse is ready and I'm going to put it in my icing bag. And just make a cut, small cut. So it's properly frosted, so that tells us it's ready. And now we'll take them out. So invert it and take a cloth and sharply just tap it. Now move these out of the way, otherwise you might damage them. They all come out. So now we're going to fill these. So let, let's get our little discs out. Carefully take it out of the tray. And you need a butter paper. And just invert this onto the butter paper. And just now just remove the sheet. So we have all our little plates ready. So I just take one of the discs and one of my cup, I just dip a slightly bit in the chocolate, not too much, and just place this in the center. So I'll do this with all of them. Just make sure you put them in the center. Now, remove the handles and dip this very lightly in the chocolate and take the cup and stick them on. Don't they look incredibly cute? And now we're going to fill them. So we have our chocolate mousse with a little coffee. Let's fill them up. Now I'm just going to pipe some cream on top. I've got some cream in the icing bag and I have a star nozzle here. That's it. So please come and have some coffee with me. Isn't this so cute?